by training that climate change is the biggest health threat of the 21st century. I made it up to Anubic, I read a book on climate change, I started asking around and it turned out they're already three degrees Celsius than they were in the 1950s. They're warming at triple the global rate. So up here, when we listen to our elders and we listen to people who know the land well, they are some of the people who can teach us the most about what's happening to our planet. And the health impacts we're already seeing up here include decreased safety of ice-based travel, which makes hunting more difficult, that brings food security issues, and we also see people having more trouble connecting with their community, and that makes people feel sad. When we speak with the elders from the high Arctic, they tell us that there didn't used to be landslides, and now there's landslides, and that's because the permafrost is melting. So we have stories to tell here in the north that we can bring to other parts of the world. And so what the children have done by bringing us here today is they've taken us from a place where everybody's fighting and everybody's talking about different things and people are vying for power in different ways. And they've said, hey, this is about all of us. This is about our health. And the best thing is that a lot of the things that we can do to improve health right now also make things better for the planet. So if we do things like we eat culturally appropriate foods from the land, but more vegetables and fruits and more legumes instead of red meat, that's going to be better for people, that's going to be better for the planet. If we walk and bike to where we want to go and we take the bus, that's going to make us healthier, keep us out of the emergency department so you don't have to come see me, and that's going to be better for the planet. If we do things like clean up our energy supply, stop making air pollution, stop sending kids to the emergency department with asthma, that's gonna be better for our health now, that's gonna be better for the planet. So I know I'm getting a lot of people coming to me as people are really understanding the place where we're at in human history and they're feeling kind of worried. Put up your hand if you're feeling kind of worried about climate change right now. Yeah, it, it's anxiety provoking, right? Now, put up your hand if it feels good to be here right now. Right? Right, wave your hands around. That's because action feels better than anxiety. Okay? So I want you to give yourself a pat on the back for coming out today because it's a little, it's a little worrisome. I'm not very good at arts and crafts. I get worried when I have to make a sign. Some people don't like it when they have to go out and show that they believe in something. So everybody here showed courage in showing up today. And what I've come to realize is courage is the major thing we need. So I want you to know that by coming out, your action has not only inspired me, but it's inspired everybody around you. What I've learned is that action feels better than anxiety. And I've also learned that inspiration is a positive feedback cycle. So when you stand up and take action, somebody else will notice and they will too. And all of a sudden we have a thousand people in a tiny town of Yellowknife out here working for this. So what I want you to remember is that action feels better than anxiety, that your courage inspires other people to have their own courage, and that a healthy planet makes for healthy people. So I went to school for 12 years to become a doctor to help with people's health, and it turns out that actually healing the planet is more important than that. So is there anyone here who's ever thought they might want to be a doctor or a nurse someday? Yeah, skip med school. <laughs> Right? What you're doing right now is as important, probably more important than anything I can do in the emergency department. So let's, I, I've got Devin who's better at this than I am. We're going to do a chant. This is the first chant I've ever tried to start at a rally. You ready? Okay? Healthy planet, healthy people, healthy planet, healthy people, healthy planet, healthy people, healthy planet, healthy people. Awesome.